My name is Wally Kurth, and I play the role of Justin Kiriakis. And I started on the show in 1987, and I left in 91. And then I came back to the show in 2009, off and on. And here it is, 2015, and I'm just back under contract. And uh, so I'm back to stay for however long that is. Well, the very first year was just amazing. Um, it was the beginning of Justin and Adrian, and um, I, my character is a, a, was part of the Greek mafia. And so uh, we, uh, once we decided to get married after a very, pretty quick, pretty quick romance, um, we decided to get married. They actually flew, we did a remote in Greece, which was incredible. Uh, I mean, I think they'd been to London, but no one, I don't think we'd ever been to Europe uh, since London. But we went to Greece for four days, shot a bunch of stuff. We did the exterior of the church. Um, there was other characters involved. And I remember just doing a scene at my parents' gravesite on this cliff overlooking, you know, the, the, the Aegean Sea below. And it was just remarkable, remarkable uh, stuff. And, and of course, I thought I would just continue, but I didn't know like the very, you know, they don't, do, they don't go to Greece. They don't do remotes, you know, every year or all that much. And, um, and then we had the, the interior uh, wedding stuff was here at St. Sophia Church in downtown Los Angeles, and that was beautiful, just beautiful. Hundreds of extras in the, in the pews, and uh, we actually had a real Greek Orthodox minister conducting the ceremony. It was just, uh, that was just a remarkable, amazing experience. And also just getting married. I had never been married before, so then you're going through all these vows and and pledging your love to this woman that you're really not marrying. However, someone told me that the, the priest, the, the, the Greek service was so accurate, so on point that we actually, in the eyes of the Greek church, we really were married because it was exactly the ceremony that you would, would be conducted at that time. So anyway, it was just, you know, it's just, it's, it's, it was just an amazing time back in, you know, when I was on the show the first go round. So now we're at the period where we see them, you know, after a whole life has sort of affected them. And uh, they're still having their troubles. They, uh, the characters just got divorced, sadly, uh, for the third time. But, um, you know, we're part of the whole 50th anniversary. And our, our son is on the show. And uh, I don't know, it's just, uh, I love the fact that we've, you know, we've, we've cut to 20 years later. And now where are they? And, and what have they been doing? And who are they? Most importantly, who are they? And they're still a family, and they still love each other, even though they're not married to each other now. But it's, um, you know, and our son just got married, and he's having troubles, and it's just, it's just been really, really remarkable and, and enjoyable from an actor standpoint. It's very exciting. I mean, being here, you know, celebrating the 50th anniversary is an incredible honor. I'm glad they invited me back. And they asked me to be a bigger part of the show by giving me a contract, and I'm just thrilled. I couldn't be happier to be a part of it. And, it's, and I love seeing the same crew that, I, that used to be around for 20, you know, 20 years ago. And, and I've been here off and on for the last five years, so I've been sort of, you know, um, I feel like it's already home again. But uh, yeah, I'm just so honored and happy to be part of the 50th anniversary and, and do my part, play my part, and, uh, and celebrate this great show with this great history. Well, I think it's the fans. And I think the fans, I see fans all the time who say, oh, I watched the show with my grandmother. I watched the show with my aunt, my mother. And maybe they are still around or not. But when they sit down and watch the show and hearing, you know, McDonald Carey's voice introduce the show, they're going back in time. And they're also spending time with that relative that may not be there right now, but they watched with them. And that's that legacy, that's what connects them, I think. And because, once again, that memory and that feeling is with their family. They can connect to all the family storytelling that we do on camera, which is all about the family, starting with Francis Reed, McDonald Carey, and the Hortons, and all the way down. It's always uh, the generational stories that we tell, and, uh, and the fans are also experiencing that generational storytelling by you know, watching their story. Here's to 50 more.